Good day everyone, Maddie from FSA Earth Moving. As promised, we'll start going through some of the new gear. And today, we've got one of my favorite bits of gear. This, he's pretty cool. It's obviously not as cool as the truck, but he's pretty cool. So let's check him out. Here he is, Dazza in the flesh, coming hot onto your TV screens. <laughs> It is a D6C, old school girl, but hasn't had a lot of work apparently. So found this actually up where we live in Gloucester, which was pretty cool. Um, came up for sale just by chance. And five months later, they redo it, did a head on it. And five months later, we finally went and picked her up. So let me run through her. She's got not a cat blade this is a komatsu blade on it so she's a she's a bit of a frankenstein so manual adjust um copped a little bit of slack about that from a couple of local guys but in a day if you can drive manual tilt auto is going to be easy she's got massive d8 yes d8 rippers on the back of her so <laughs> backing up hills it doesn't really like there's just so much weight over the rear end and then you can't drive up hills because it just chucks a mono so you know dad and i have been talking um and are and whether we're going to take them off um but at this stage they're staying on also got big protection she's got new tracks on her i think it had new rollers as well from memory um had the turbo all checked out <laughs> a few weeks after we got it did a starter motor She's got a new exhaust, so she's she's been around, but what an epic bit of gear. Jump up, you know. So apparently all this is being custom made. So it's all it's pretty comfy actually. Obviously blade ripper. Um, all the gauges work by the RPM, which isn't a big deal. Never been in a dozer. It's called a D accelerator. Obviously your brakes. That's how you steer to the right, steer to the left. Over here it's got power shift, which is awesome. Brake safety, you know, click her in, click her in. Nice and easy to use compared to the D4. So it's it's pretty quick to operate actually. Pretty good view. Anyway, we'll start her up. And the old guy that we had check her out, he reckons she's been tuned up, so she's got extra power. So before I started, actually, it's it came from a place out west, and it got donated to Newcastle TAFE. Newcastle? It was one of the TAFEs anyway. Sydney TAFE, must have been Sydney. And the old TAFE teacher there, they obviously pulled her apart. They've done a lot of things, like they've modified where the transmission filter goes, and they've done a lot of little little things on it that aren't standard. And then went to up to a property up here that the Sydney TAFE teacher owned, and they sold it with the property, and then they got, the boys used it for a bit, and they said they weren't going to clear anymore and need another tractor. So, yeah, we, we bought it off them. And, um, yeah, we haven't done a lot of work with it. Um, every time I've used it, <laughs> good old dozers she's done she breaks a hose or we snapped one of those mounts out which apparently is pretty common when i took it to the engineer place like yeah there's another komatsu blade up here and he snaps them all the time so you know it's little things like that that i'm learning about anyway let's start her up see how she goes
go. Old Dazza. Still kind of finding out the limits of the Dazza. Went and did a bit of clearing up on that top ridge up there and it goes all right. You just got to, with the rippers on the back, as I was saying, you really just got to know where you're going to turn around, really, because as I said, it doesn't really like backing up with them. I don't know what's the weight. I had the mechanic check it out because it really feels like to me like the, the brakes are dragging a bit, but he reckons it's normal. So anyway, as you know, I've only driven D11s before and then they're old little D4. So you know, it's a bit, a bit of a difference, but I'm learning. We're, work, we're working things out. Still got a few hoses that I'm going to replace purely just for the fact that they're, they're perished. Like it's just things that happen with old dozers but anyway i hope you found this video pretty awesome please give me a like subscribe and probably do a job next i'll fill, film a job next and then we'll bring up the truck all right guys have a good one